the Faculty of Education. Thank you for choosing us and for tuning in today. I am Vela Pimakwatla, the Head of Faculty in Student Administration at the Grundluft Campus. We are thrilled to welcome you into our family. Congratulations on successfully completing Grade 12 despite the uncertainties of the COVID-19 pandemic. Passing metric well is a remarkable milestone in the journey of life. Admission to a tertiary institution is an achievement on its own. Congratulations once again for managing to secure a place in the faculty of choice. You are also encouraged to use your time wisely to make learning opportunity a priority for you in order to succeed. Teaching is an honorable profession and it is a mother of all professions. We are looking at the next generation of teachers. Teaching and learning has changed for the better and it is for this reason we all had to accept adjust, adapt to the new normal. In the midst of all encounters, life goes on and education is still a key to success. Education lessens the challenges you will face in life. The more knowledge you gain, the more opportunities will open up to allow individuals to achieve better possibilities in career and in potential growth. Indeed, we are the faculty of choice. We receive a multitude of applications annually and only applicants who best suits our admission criteria are considered. It is critical to register for the compulsory academic orientation module, UPO 109, from the onset. It is advisable to in invest in a smartphone and a laptop to succeed during this era. Although our qualifications are designed as contact mode, you will be studying online depending on the COVID alert level at a particular time and space. Student administration is one of the most important units within the faculty. It is your first contact with the university. It is unlikely that you will complete your degree without our intervention. Our services range from applications, admissions, registrations, examinations and graduations. We are here to support you through your journey in completing your qualifications. The following members are responsible for undergraduate qualifications. And my portfolio consists of four business units. The undergraduate division, Chandim Gomezulu is the manager in this unit. We've got Manana Chabalala, responsible for BET Foundation Phase and PGCE. Ms. Tandim Gomezulu, responsible for B8 Intermediate Phase. Mr. Lucky Masetha, responsible for B8 Senior Phase and FET. The surnames starting from A to M, including MA to MH. Then we've got Ms. Monica McKenna, responsible for Senior Phase, FET, the surnames M's, MI to MZ, including N to Z. Then we've got the unit for distance education. It is responsible for the higher certificate in sports sciences and other distance education qualifications. The manager there is Ms. MC Pick, administrative officer, it's Ms. Leta Nyoni, or Ms. Aniki Dibrain, responsible for the higher certificate in sports sciences. The Student Services Center and Finance. The following officials are designated accordingly. The finance office deals with student accounts and other source of funding. There we have Balungi Lehlongwa, Ms. Mutlazi Matlakala, they are dealing with Funza Lushaka. Then we've got Ms. Mutlalepule Sebutsane, dealing with NSFAS and the UP Assist. The Student Services Center is responsible for counter duties. These duties include student cards, parking, cashier duties and general inquiries on rotation. We have Ms. Betty Ngobo, Ms. Gazelle Buckley, Ms. Jackie Mabukela, and Ms. Reta Nev. There is also a postgraduate division, just in case you are keen to pursue your studies after completion of your degree. Note, as a result of the pandemic, we are currently working from home to reduce the number of infections by avoiding contact where possible. There is skeleton staff available on rotation depending on the COVID alert level at the time. You are encouraged to visit our faculty website to access staff contact details. You are welcome to send your inquiries by means of email should you inquire administrative assistance. 
All applicants must be registered at least by the 21st of February 2022. In order to be able to view the study material online using the UP student portal called ClickUp, also linked to the UPO 109, the academic orientation module. Changing of phases or qualification is not encouraged because a sponsor approved for specific subjects based on their needs. Due to financial implications, especially if you are funded by FUNZA, Ushaka, the scheme will withdraw the funding. Double dipping means being funded by two or more schemes. The most common ones are NSFAS and FUNZA Lishaka and other sponsors depending on their terms and conditions. If you have been awarded multiple sponsors, please inform our finance office without delay and avoid unpleasant situations which might have a negative impact on your studies. Ensure that you familiarize yourself with the package coordinators, the faculty student advisors, the faculty manager during your journey. The next session with other stakeholders will address other topics of concern. Enjoy your stay with us and fly at UP. All of the best.